Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to compare uh, two brand, not, maybe not brand new cameras, but uh, we are going to compare full frame camera like A7C, you can see right now, it's a full frame camera, and we are going to compare it with A6700, so it's an APS-C camera, and we are going to see uh, what's the difference between noise that sensor made in a low light condition and as a7c we are going to pair with uh, right now you can see 27 24 to 70 f 2.8 of course and it's a g master lens designed for full frame cameras and we are going to see this put together and on the a7 uh, and on the A6700, we are going to put this lens. It's 16 to 55 f 2.8 G lens, and this lens is of course designed for APS-C camera. Of course, at the beginning you can also see the size difference between these two lenses. It's kind of huge difference, and we will be comparing these noises from full frame and APS-C in a three situations. The first one is generally, generally very dark situation without any street lights because I'm going to make these videos uh, outdoor. The second one is we are also in the similar place but with a street lights so it will be uh, much more light in here. And the third situation is that I'm going to put the camera to a uh, uh, exposure set to uh, around zero and I'm going to pump up that ISO and lower the aperture that the camera all the time shows around zero exposure and we will see different um, setups of ISO and what are the noises. Okay so that's it and let's go straight to the point. And we are already on uh, the place I choose for this comparison and it's uh, some kind of parking in the city and at the beginning we have that first situation I said about so we have no artificial light of the street lights so it's kind of dark in here as uh, we will see in the moment and as you can see in the bottom I am raising the ISO uh, smoothly and on the left side we've got A6700 and on the right it's a full frame A7C. And we are already on ISO 1000 and at least at this moment uh, you are not able to see too much difference. It's also still uh, dark but we are getting around 3000 already and in this uh, moment I think that we are already seeing a little bit of changes and we start seeing some noises on the crop sensor camera so APS-C around I think 3000, 6000 is already getting some noise you can also see in the bottom you uh, know in the bottom but on the top of the uh, frame that I've got I made there three two not three two pieces uh, side by side to see better close one to another how that noises looks like and already at six, uh, 1600 we can see how the noises are strong getting stronger on the APS-C and at 20,000 you can already see that all the image is floating you can see a lot of this uh, noises and it's not looking good and at least I think that uh, ISO around 10,000 on the APS-C is some kind of um, still usable but uh, when we are raising it higher it's getting to look not uh, very interesting and look at the same time at this uh, that the uh, full frame image is getting uh, brighter and brighter and brighter and at the max ISO, which is 102,000, it 
it is still less noisy than APS-C camera at its ISO which was 32,000 so it's kind of weird thing I suppose and right now we are at this second situation maybe as you can see already the street lights are on already in this uh, example and again on the left side APS-C on the right side full frame frame camera and I started to raise that ISO again and in this time it will get brighter very bright a lot a lot of a lot sooner so so you can also see the differences around this ISO maybe a little bit faster and at the same and the same time the same story on the top of the frame you can you have two pieces and you can see they're side by side very close the same uh, pieces of the frame and okay we are around 1000 ISO already and I think that uh, we can see in this moment already some kind of differences when the APS-C sensor is start to appear in some uh, noise and this noise is just getting harder and stronger and on the right side the full frame image look how it uh, it's it's looking clear it's so clear right now that at, low, at least I cannot say that there is any noise on the full frame and on the APS-C we can already see that this uh, sensor is giving us some noise and you can also see that this noise is some kind of floating around the frame it's moving so it's also making this frame a lot lot much worse and right now we are around 10,000 ISO as you can see on the bottom and as I said I think that this 10,000 is some kind of maximum usable uh, ISO for the APS-C maybe 12,000 and I think that ISO around 16,000 it's not too good idea to do this because you can see how much noise is this camera giving and okay we are getting much closer to the maximum ISO of A6700 right now we are on the 32,000 so it's a maximum for an APS-C camera in a video mode and right now we are going to raise that ISO still in the full frame camera so you can see that how much brighter we can go and look on the smaller frames uh, in here and see how much side by side the full frame sensor gives less noise and it's on its maximum and it's still less noisy than APS-C camera so I think it's kind of interesting and you should mention it when you are choosing your camera and choosing your lenses you are going to use with this setup so and the next and the last situation is I am putting the exposure on the camera around zero that camera shows and bump up that ISO as you can see right now we are on a 3200 and I am changing just aperture to, give, to get that equivalent of zero uh, exposure in the, in the camera so around 300 to 3000 we are already seeing that APS-C on the right side gives you more noise and right now we are on a 8000 ISO and we've got still the same story and the APS-C give us much and stronger noise and it's uh, clear to see just take a look on the road just take a look on the uh, brighter parts of the frame and we are on the 12,800 and look how the 
noise is uh, moving around the frame when you are watching the street you can clearly see that that noise is appearing stronger and stronger right now at least a7c on the left side looks like it gets no noise at all and the last iso i checked uh, in this uh, case is 20,000. and uh, it's clear to say that APS-C starts to get soft and very very noisy it's also a, some kind of color noise in the frame as uh, we, a lot of people say it's like that and the most interesting thing for me is that this uh, full frame sensor added that high uh, numbers of the ISO still looks clear still looks very good and even it's the a7c and it's not the newest camera but it looks very very much better okay guys that's uh, everything for today what i made for you in this video i hope that you will like subscribe and comment below uh, and that's it thank you for watching see you guys